Hello friends, welcome to this team test. As you know, I am creating a Joomla 2.5 module development playlist. So I have created a video how to create Joomla 2.5 module in the previous video. Now in this screencast, I will demonstrate how to create Joomla 2.5 module and how to accept different parameter from the backend. So for this demonstration, I will create a simple application called Twitter module. So in the back end, administrator will give the Twitter username and from the Twitter username, we will display a link in the front end to his Twitter page. So let's start. So I have created a folder called Twitter. So now we have to create minimum two files like mod underscore twitter.php another is mod underscore twitter.xml and for security reason we will create a blank index.html file to prevent directory listing so we have created these three files let's open this with your editor i am using sublime text so i have opened these three files so let's uh, write some blank html code save and close this file now in the mod underscore twitter dot xml we will write our module configuration and in the mod underscore twitter dot php we will write our php code so let's define the module configuration so let's start the xml syntax xml version 1.0 now create a node extension extension close this node and mention few attributes like extension type is module version for which joomla version we are creating module for joomla 2.5 that's why i have put it version 2.5.0 and method you can use the install also if i use the upgrade if the extension already exists then it will automatically update that's why i have used the upgrade so you may ins install now we will define some parameters let's say name of the module twitter author author version of the module 1.0.2 and module description description this is our twitter module ok now we will mention our module files so create a files node files now we will def define our files and folder so we have not used any folder we have used three files so we will define each of this file so let's create a file name node file name that is mod underscore twitter dot xml let's close the file node file name another file name index.html file name and one more file name mod underscore twitter dot php file name now we have to mention which is the module file so this is the module file so we to define module mod underscore twitter so we have defined our required files now we will write some basic configuration so create a config node we have created now we need to accept some parameter from the backend so we have to create fields so fields field f i l d s fields 
now give a name of the fields param params and now we will create different group of field so we have to create field set field set let's name basic give a label um basic module config okay close the field set now we will create different field so inside field set we will create field field type we will accept the twitter username so it should be a text so name tw username label give a label enter twitter username and one more so copy paste anchor text text so enter text this time uh, we will use a default value so default follow me on twitter so we have created our xml file now switch to the php file so at first we need to check whether my file is called by joomla not accessing by outside so we will check defined underscore j e x e c or die access denied now whenever user administrator will uh, save this parameter we can get this parameter using dollar params variable so using the dollar params variable we can retrieve this following information like twitter username and anchor text so let's get this parameter value into different variable so dollar twitter username dollar params get name of your field so let's copy paste now we have to one more anchor text so name this anything so we have uh, collected different two parameters now we will create a link so echo reference now here http twitter.com slash the username provided by the administrator so we will concatenate dollar t w twitter username and we will place the anchor text also anchor text so we have created our simple twitter follow link module now let's review the all the things xml extension type module we are creating for joomla 2.5 method upgrade you can also install install name twitter author version description files we required three files mod underscore twitter dot xml file name index dot html and another file name mod underscore twitter this is the module file we have mentioned our configuration we are accepting two parameters twitter username another is anchor text so let's give this so right click compress you can zip or use tar.gz create so i have created the zip now visit your administrator section extension manager select your file
select your zip and upload and install mod underscore twitter dot xml file not exit so let's check mod underscore dot xml it's already exist mod underscore twr ttr spelling is oh that's a problem yeah save again delete the previous archive file copy compress now try to install upload and install this time install successfully so extension module manager here we can see a twitter module instance created so let's click on that so select a position let's we want to display this select our template put our middle section publish we want to display in the home page and here you can see we have two parameters twitter username anchor text and we have appeared the default text so enter the twitter username so i'm entering my twitter username now click save so i have saved the module now visit your site and now here look at the bottom of the site here i can see a twitter we have placed the title test save refresh yes we can also hide the title by selecting hide save refresh this page as you can see and the, look at the bottom link if i click here i am redirecting to twitter so you can see I redirect to Twitter. Now the benefits of the module we can create several instances from the same module. So let's create another instance. So create new Twitter. Give a name. Let's say media media tweet select a position now this time i want to display it in a page one and page three now i am entering username let's select a username called google google and I want to change the anchor text view Google tweets so click on the save he press the home page we cannot see anything because we have assigned this to page 1 and page 3 so if I click on the page 1 here in the bottom I can see and the link pointing to twitter.com slash google and in the same as in the page 3 also we can see the title and the anchor text view google tweets has changed so if i click on that i am redirecting to twitter.com slash google so in this way we can create different instance of module using different parameter so thank you if you have any question then write your question i try to solve your problem thanks